Okay. Hey. I decided to actually do it because of nothing else to do. Because it's like a holiday, a blah, whatever. So. Let's get to it. I'm gonna skip past all the part where everyone picks their hero. Because that's not important. What is important though. Is watching you. And me. I'm this guy. Walking into the room. So. Hi. Anyways. I'm just gonna try to like say that all the things you do right, you do wrong, what you need to improve, blah blah blah. And I remember this very clearly, like it was yesterday, because it was. That these this clown right here. Just watch him. So he sees these two guys and we're just sitting by the room doing what we're supposed to. Look, look how far away we are. We're not even moving, right? He just walks in. Go piggy. So Another thing, these guys down here should be at this rune. There should be two people that contesting every rune at least. He almost dies, but he makes it out. And then you pick up the rune and you do exactly what you should do. You should walk in the lane. Legion even comes, which is weird, because she's supposed to be like jungling or some shit, but... Uh, I guess she walked all the way from Thought, then whatever. So... Alright, I'm gonna pause the game real quick. So after you pick up the rune, your creeps are right here. Or mouses. What you can do, and this is like pro Dota shit, you can stand in front of your creeps so that you know how like um, there's collision, so they can't like walk through you. So if you like continuously stand in front of them, it will make them come out slower. If you saw, if you saw like what it was, like actually did, it'd make a lot more sense. I want to see if uh, if uh, Conker does it. Hold on. I have fog on... okay. Where is Kunkka? Kunkka's right here. Oops. Alright, I'm kinda new with these like... Ooh. Okay. Kunkka, show me what you got. Alright. So Kunkka gets bot rune, see if he does it. Yeah, he does it. See, like, it was kind of shitty because he didn't do very well. But he kind of stood in front of the creeps, so they, the creeps hit him. And they didn't keep walking forward. Anyways, that's just a little thing. It's not that big of a deal. Alright, I'm going to go back to your perspective. Alright. Skills are good. You don't have a courier, which sucks. So, right now they're just laning. No biggie. And... I can tell you, like, oh, you gotta farm better, but that's just something that comes to practice. I wouldn't worry too much about that. But what you're doing right here is really bad. So, right now, you're auto attacking creeps. Which, what that does is, first of all, it, gets, it makes it really hard to get the last hit. You're supposed to, like, time it just so you kill them. And what else it does is it also pushes the lane. So you see how you have two creeps alive and he has one, you have two creeps when he's dead. That means these two creeps are going to walk into his tower right here and then it will make it super easy for him to farm and super hard for you to like get any like harass or damage or anything because you can't like walk up here. It's like you have no vision, there's going to be a tower if you try to dive, but if you're if like if he pushes the wave then you could farm right here and you're like safe from ganks, You um, it's easy to harass, he can't dive you, shit like that. So. No auto attack he the creeps too good. No it's good. Kunkka has this ability. It's a tidebringer. It's the cleave thing, so every single time he attacks a, a creep, the lane's gonna push. So like if you um don't auto attack the creeps, you just try to get the last hits, the lane will literally always be like right here. And I'm pretty sure Lion rotated to kill you a lot. I bet that's because eventually you were like standing over here because the creeps are already here because like you're pushing them. But if you were standing right here, it would have been so much harder for you to die. Because you would have had to walk, and it's like, instead of like, walking up here, and like, standing right here to kill you when you're right here, you'd have to, you'd be like, right here, and you'd have to like, awkwardly sit here while Kunkka's walking up this into the tower. It'd just be like, you'd just live so much more. Alright, I'm on pause. I can do this more. I know this is like, a kind of a bad, this is a kind of a bad game to do this with, because... I'm pretty sure this is the game where I was, let's see how I'm doing. I was lagging really bad, eventually, not right now. I remember I was good right here, but, okay, one last hit. All right, let's see how you're doing. Yeah. See, now you're over here while all your creeps are still alive. 
I'm guessing you just used that ability to see what it did. So, you walk back, which is good. You shouldn't be, there's like no point in standing right here other than just auto attacking, but that's not that important right now. I, I'm pretty sure you just tried to buy a bottle, but you didn't have a courier. So, you just, it just hits you, the realization. Alright, you get that last hit. Nice, bro. Another thing, I remember you getting ganked a lot. Oh, you missed that creep. Uh, you're getting ganked a lot. You don't have any wards, which is, I guess, our support player, which is this guy's fault. This is the guy who like had that rune thing. Oh, let's watch him die. But um, oh, he didn't die. Um, that also would have helped a lot. Make sure you're always watching a minimap. If lion's missing, or maybe whoever the fuck's down here, I think Legion comes up, then you'll know he's probably ganking you. Oh, and obviously the rune spawns right now. But you don't have your bottle, so it doesn't even matter. Because you don't have a courier. Bow, last it. Boom, cash money. Holla. So, what's what our bot lane is doing? Our bot lane is... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shh. Okay, nothing happened. That's kind of lame. So, right now, like a, a normal game with higher MMR, Lion would probably be rotating to kill you once the rune, like, he might even get this rune at two minutes. Also, if he was like a professional, he'd run at the rune at two minutes to save it, so he makes sure his mid hero gets it. And if he sees you walking towards it and him not, he'd just pick it up and then walk away. So like, it guarantees you don't get it. First oh my god, he got first place. Oh, looks like we die. Oh shit, look at me go. No. Oh, oh the self. I'm so good, Jago. Oh my god. I thought I died there. Okay. Yeah, don't be afraid to use his ability to farm. Don't be afraid to use like your mana to farm like in Smite. You know how like every wave you kill something with mana? It's not exactly the same in this game, but if you can get like two last hits guaranteed. Are you walking back to base now? Yeah, because you don't have your bottle and need mana and stuff. If you can get like two last hits by using your Q that you can't, or even one last hit by using your ability that you couldn't before. Oh nice, we find the courier. And just do it because like mana, you have your bottle, you should have your bottle, but there's no courier. And like you can just refill it, there's runes, get easy mana, it's all good, it's all good. Last hits are more important right now than having mana. Because you're not really rotating right now, and as long as you're not like in danger of dying, because like you have no mana for like your leap, which you don't even have because you're this hero, then you're fine. Okay, let's see how top's doing. So Lion's missing oh no he's not, you see him now. This Kanka is very playing very um passive. He's also doing this really shitty build where he gets two and X marks a spot. Which is Alright, I'm gonna explain Kanka real quick. So Kanka is like this mid hero that you'll very rarely go against or sometimes you go against him. This is a stun. It's basically you know how like the Kraken like knocks people up? It's basically the Kraken, but instead of like a bunch of damage, it does like a stun. It, it's like, it comes out after like a, a second delay. This is a, a big AoE cleave. This is weird. It's like, it's um... His ulti, it's just like a big boat. And then it crashes down where he wants it to. Like, like it would crash down right here. And then it does a bunch of damage. It stuns as a huge AoE. He can't cast it like right in front of him though. It takes a while for it to come out. But we'll see if we get this last hit. Do it, Jacob! Yeah! Um... Oh, he killed someone. And um... After he does it, people get something called delay damage, where if they take like 100 damage, they'll take like, or they take like 50 damage, or 200, or 1000, they'll take like 100 damage, and then 100 damage, and like ticks, until they take all 1000 of the damage, so like, they take longer to kill, even though they take the same amount of damage, it just takes longer for the damage to come. Okay, what just happened? This is us diving the Undying, except I'm just like, in my own little happy place, because that wasn't going to work out. Let's see if they kill someone. Oh, that was the boat. Oh no. Okay, I'm gonna res I missed that, so I'm going to jump back. 20 seconds. Okay. Here you are. No mana. That's alright though. You don't need mana. You should use a bottle right now. Get your mana back. Okay, so here comes the turret. Here comes the boat. Boom. Kunkka like thinks you died, but then he comes up for the kill. So what happened there? That was just. How you could have avoided that? Well, if you had, if you used a bottle, you would have enough mana for Death Pulse to heal you. 
Also, if you weren't just auto, oh shit, is this there's no way this guy's gonna get the kill. I don't know what the hell he's doing. Um, also, if you were standing a little bit back, because you were just auto, you were just sitting here just auto attacking creeps. But if you were just like waiting, like a little, maybe a little bit farther back, so that you can <laughs> look at this guy. What the fuck is he doing? Um, if you're just waiting a little bit farther back, so that uh, to wait maybe for the creeps. That oh, oh, that guy, Jacob. Oh, okay. Um, he also that guy and cutie me to kill them. But um. What was I saying? Maybe like stand like back here. Then there's no way that he could have torn at you. Because like he wouldn't have vision of you. Because the creeps are over here. And just just missing. Okay. Yeah, use your Q to heal. It's fine. Use your bottle when like you have no mana. Learn to last it. Cough, cough. This guy is like a reckless, like a fucking... You know those like monster truck rallies? This guy's like monster truck, like he just runs over cars and shit. He doesn't care what he goes over. And you need to like die a lot for it. Watch, let's watch this. Alright, this actually does work out. So we're not gonna watch that, because I remember that. And that just like goes against everything I just said. Yeah. Let's see how you're doing. Don't Oh. Yeah, see you're standing too far up, so Lion just like stood right here and just murdered your ass. Yeah. Cause you were you like So I'm gonna restart that. Okay, that was just a that was just an animation glitch. I'm restarting. So like you walk up here to hit the creeps, but you don't need to do that because it didn't really accomplish anything at all. And then Lion just walks. Like, he's, I guess he was standing right here. And he just fucking f's you up, which is like a stupid place to be for him. But it worked out because all the reasons I just said. Okay. This is where I'm still good, I remember. Looking fly, I'm looking fresh. How's our bot lane going? A rookie only has 17 last hits and a warlock has 5. So, warlock's not having a very good game. Still dead. Do TP in like a pro? Do, nice. Oh, look at this guy, just like walking around, just fucking head in the air, like. Here I am. Yeah, I don't know what he's doing. You're just farming away. That's good. You shouldn't. This is exactly what you should be doing right now. Boom. Use your bottle. Use your bottle. Yeah, you should use your bottle a lot more. It gets refilled so often, it doesn't even matter. Just use it. Oh. These guys are going in for a kill. Also, don't be afraid to use a regen. Like, this stuff it doesn't even matter. Like, once you pit like 10 minutes into the game, it's kind of worthless. And you don't really need to sell it because it's like also like not worth a lot of money. Like so, instead of like just queuing there and like using all your mana and having full health, you could just bottle it and had both full health and mana. I died there. Wah. baby rage. Okay, so now you're walking top, probably to try to gank. But I was already dead by the time you hit right here, so you should have recognized that and just went instantly back. You also want to check the room, which is good, but it was gone. So as soon as you like walked right here. You should just realize you would have vision on the rune. You just should have realized it was gone. You should just back. All right, right here you're in range for dying, and he just try to—he does try to kill you, but he misses, which is good. He also has a double damage, so if he got that turn off, you would have been dead 100%. But you're lucky you missed. Cool. Okay. Bottom is you missing. get. Wow. Okay. All right. So what happened? <laughs> Whoa. Okay. Wow. Well, sun is like a party in your lane, and you weren't invited. Um, these two people down here, like the guy who's supposed to be farming and the person who's supposed to also be farming, because these two are like very farm kind of heroes, they just fucking walked all the way up here, stood in here for like a few seconds until you were behind your tower and then killed you. Alright, there's no way in hell you could have like seen that coming. That was actually just like one of those stupid things that works out. Okay, so even if, even though you died, Four people came mid, Lion came too, you didn't do anything, and you just wasted so much time that they could have been using farming and like doing other shit, like honestly all they got out of that was like a hundred gold each, but if they just stood down here for like the two minutes they wasted, they would have gotten like at least like 400 gold farming creeps and getting some experience. Alright, so like even though like that's bad, it's still like value, and like even Lion came just to waste his own time, so, what is, Phantom Laser's not on your team, oh okay. Yeah, you, you're dead here. 
Um, you should have seen the Phantom Lancer. You had vision of him right here. And the fact that you didn't was just like, kind of... Just like... You should have noticed he was right there. So they'll usually stand like right, if they're ganking you, they'll usually come from like down this river. And then if you're like, you're standing right here, they'll walk up here and then they'll appear right here. Or, that, which is exactly what he did, and he just stood right here. Even though you saw him, you still like kind of walked up, which is why he died. Which is uh, just, just like, you know, yeah. classic mistake. Yeah. But... I think everything else is clean. I'm gonna need you to do the dishwasher. Alright. Right, so okay. I'm trying to do something right now then. Alright. Let's go, baby. Come on. Downstairs. Come on. One side. Uh, I'm trying to do something right now. Stop. Alright. Sorry, I was talking about the bed. Um Alright, let's just take a second and we'll see what the like the the gist of the game is right now. So if we turn on fog for both teams, we can see exactly what every team sees. I have to unpause the game first. Alright. So Fan Lancer, he is their carry. He is their safe lane carry. And right now, he has two assists from geeking you both times. And 23 last hits. Usually if you're carry... Okay, so now I'm going to go over basic dynamics for carries and whatever. Because this is really important shit. And you've only played mid, so you have no idea. Um, this is basically like, probably the most important part of the video. Because this is like the basic shit everyone should get down before they play a role. So, this is... Their, they have like a weird draft. They didn't draft... They didn't like lay... They have... Okay, their picks are good, but they didn't lane the way they should have. Like... If this is a good, like, a pro get not pro get so it's single draft we're playing right now, so they didn't, like, pick their heroes, they, like, got the three heroes, blah, blah, blah. This is what they ended up with. Kanko is your normal mid. Right now, he is doing fucking fantastic. So, he's 58 last hits, which is crazy good. Three kills, which is also crazy good. He's level 10, so you're level 8, which is, like, insane. And right now, he's going to end up carrying the game, because he's so far ahead of everyone else now. This is bit like Kunkka's not one of those early game carry heroes, but if he gets so far ahead like this, and like even if he doesn't have like crit to cleave when he auto attacks with his Tidebringer, it'll still do a shit ton of damage if you guys are fighting as five. Plus this guy's like legitimately good at this Dota game. So he knows how to hit his spells. Now this is one of the This makes me sad. But um <laughs> wow. Oh, okay. So um Legion Commander should be in jungle. That's where she's not. She's playing like support. She's playing like this weird like support role. But I also need farm, so I'm just gonna like sit in lane and steal my carries last hits kind of role, which is like just typical. If you just like went into the jungle right now, she would just find so much more farm, and she wouldn't have to deal with these two like assholes from our team just like hitting her. Um, Legion commander, you farm or like you stay. This is basically how you play Legion or like jungler in general is you go in the jungle fucking click on these creeps until you get like level 6 and like a blink dagger and then you walk out of the jungle you walk in the mid lane you blink on this poor motherfucker in mid and like you ult his ass and he dies that's like the dream like you get your blink and then bam you gank mid or some shit like uh most most uh junglers end up getting blink unless you're like a jungle life suit or like axe will get blink and then do that thing where he has makes you attack them there's this character called doom who has this like ultimate that like silences you uh legion's ult is like she makes you duel her and the winner gets damage which she did do in mid but she didn't she like did it to you like back here which is weird so right now he's not where he's supposed to be but it's not and look he only has 19 last hits usually at 10 minutes or even 11 10 minutes 10 minutes in the game if you're playing carry and you have like a good lane you should have 50 last hits right um and then at, like the general rule of thumb is you're okay if like ever for every 10 minutes you have 50 last hits so like 30 minutes in the game you have 150 if you're playing carry so legion right now is like really eating the shit 
she was yeah so until the top lane lion right now okay so lion he's supposed should be playing support he shouldn't be top he should play he, the lay it should be he should be with the pl bottom i don't know what the pl is doing now he's like walking around which is bad because he's supposed to be farming yeah, yes, he only has like 23 last hits, so he don't, like, cause, because like, he like, we went mid and like, is like, roaming and ganking you. He like, he has so many less items and gold than he should have right now. Especially considering like, these two guys are like, fucking, the goon squad and don't do anything. Like, anyways. Lion should be down here, spoiling PL, making sure these goon, the goon squad doesn't F with him. So he can farm and get those 50 last hits so he can carry the game eventually. But right now he's like going, he went top with this guy and against me. Uh -huh. And like they just, they just did whatever. Like, they didn't like trade that well. It was just like a normal lane. Um, but what line is doing that's really good is now he's ganking as a support. Right now, and like, Especially since he got his own lane where he can get like a lot of experience in. He's like level 7. He's only like one level behind you. Like, shit like that. Um, he can help kill heroes really easily. Especially Finger Death it does like fucking 600 damage right now. Like, like I don't know how much health you have, but I only have 800. That'll leave me with like more than less than half my health. Follow that up with like a stun. It's like really easy to kill the mid hero right now. Which is you, which is what he's doing. So, good for him. He was in bot and he did the same thing. Like, this is the this is like the dream. PL gets the 50 last hits. He has like a fucking drum or some shit right now. And then he can lane by himself versus these two fools without any trouble. And then Lion can just walk around and gank people. And then like every single one of your lanes will win. Now on to him dying. That's like general support thing. He's also not really warding. Actually, is he? Whose ward is this? Acheron? He is warding. Good for him. He is playing support. He's just doing it in the wrong place. So basically, like, he's doing everything right, except he should be bot instead of top. You, for, like, a support, you gank mid. You TP into the... You TP the heroes when they're getting dived. So if, like, these two guys went on Legion, you, like, TP in. You, like, counter kill them at their tower. and Which he, he should have TP right now, which he doesn't, which is bad. But, and also, you gank, you ward, and you TP and you make sure your carry can get farm. That's basically the gist of support. And then later in the game, you just disable people during team fights. And that's supporting Dota game. Um, Undying. Undying should be offline right now by himself. He has like all these abilities that make him good for like, for like the first 15 minutes. And then he's kind of like, meh. But like he's like really, really good in the first 15 minutes. But like he's not doing anything right now. He's like in a dual lane versus me and him. And he just like, me and like this truck driver guy he didn't do shit like his farm is okay like not that great and bleh, whatever all right so i was oh offlane you kind of just get item you just like stay in your lane you get a bunch of experience because even if you don't get the last hits the creeps still die by you and you like and you're by yourself so you get all of it and the goal is to like not be pushed out of lane it's really easy to die, so even if like you have less than everyone else, it's not a big deal. Like you don't get mad at your off laner for dying first blood because it's like supposed to happen. And then like you, and then like you just get those items. You can like rotate eventually once you hit like six or something, and then you can gank mid whatever. And then who, does it doesn't even matter if this tower dies if you're gone, as long as you don't like push this tower while you're gone. It's fine. Right. And basically, you have 22 last hits, 4 deaths. That's just because, you know, all the reasons I explained. Our carry, which is me, I'm doing okay. I don't have as many last as I should be. That's because I was going against Undying in Lion, which is like a really good dual off lane. And my Sphere Breaker just like is running around everywhere. He's in the lane right now, but before it was just like fucking truck driving it everywhere. These two guys are like, I don't know how long this is, I don't want this to be like over like way too long, because I know it can get boring after a while, but, okay, I'm just going like, to unpause the game while I talk so it sucks faster. This game is almost over, because eventually someone leaves and it's not worth watching anymore. Oh, well, let's see if these guys kill each other. 
Oh shit. Oh shit. He got the slow. Oh no. This guy's coming in for the duel. He's not gonna get it though. Oh my god, he's going. What the fuck is this guy doing? Whoa, he's crazy. And he just dies. Alright. Oh shit. Shit's happening in mid. You're dead. Okay, I'm restarting in 10 seconds. Alright, so. You TP in after you died. This is good. This is exactly what you should be doing. This guy's crazy. He's like walking all the way up there. Right now, you should be queuing, auto attacking. Oh no, and then Lion comes. Ditch, ditch! Yeah. So what happened there is Lion came to gank you. And that's why he died. Which is kind of just like unfortunate. If you had a ward, I think you do have a ward actually, do you? No, that's their ward. If you had a ward, you would have known. Okay, I'm actually going to restart like 10 seconds and see exactly when you saw that line. Like from your vision. Okay. You saw him right now. You should be ditching right now. But you don't. You keep going because you don't notice him. If you like, you saw him when you're right here. If you ditched everyone you're back here, you wouldn't have died. And you also wouldn't be able to kill that line without any deaths. And maybe even the Kunkka. That's just like over aggression. Just like... It's 2v1. I know this guy was coming, but he was going to be late, so you should have just, like, ran away. That's, like, something, like, that's, like, you have to know the game. Even I, like, would probably still go in for that, because I'm, like, still, like, not that great. But, middle tower is under attack. hindsight's 20, 20 This guy walks back to base. Whatever. This is ulti. Say hello to Warlock home. Here I am, just doing whatever the fuck I do. Let's see if we kill this guy. Oh, Oh, this is bold. I hate this. Alright. Yeah, I die here. Just watch me die. Look at me diving. I thought this guy would come up with me, but he just like... He even comes in at like the last second to all attack this guy. Once. Whatever, not important. Alright, so... I'm guessing you... Yeah, you don't have money for TPC. Walk back to lane, which is fine. Right now you're 0-5. I'm pretty sure you start getting some kills soon. Which is good. Good, good. So... Don't be afraid of that Legion. That Legion's like... Dyer's top tower is under attack. So where is he? He's a one and two. He's level seven. You're level eight. I don't think he can solo. He can, there's no way he can solo kill you. Yeah, that's good. That's exactly what you need to do. But you should auto attack this those two creeps so you got the last hits afterwards. Dyer's top tower okay. has fallen. Yeah, you're like playing super scared right now. But Kunkka's top. Okay, um, but you don't know that because you can't see him. So you're actually doing what you're supposed to be doing right now because none of their heroes are showing. So you don't know where any of them are. But now you see that they're top, so you should be getting aggressive, which you are doing. Good, good, good. Um, he's going into Legion. The Legion doesn't even see him. Perfect. Cue him. Ult him. Perfect. He's dead. That was exactly what you should have done. That was, like, pristine. Like, good job. If you have an L time, good. Middle tower is under I don't know why Super Picker is hitting that tower, he should be doing other things. I don't know what Ricky's doing, he's like, he's mid's dead, bro. But, um... What is that Ricky doing? Oh, he found like, a PL in the jungle. But, there's no way you can kill that guy, right? Oh, oh, oh. So, they're not gonna get this kill, I think. They are gonna get this kill, absolutely. Okay, um... Yeah, that was good in them. Good job, team. You should be helping these guys right now. You shouldn't just be standing here, because it's... If you were here, and you had, like, a Q, you would get, like, standing right here, you would just kill this guy. And they wouldn't have to be, like... If, the, if this was, like, a normal game... Yeah, see, like, support... Like, people would TP in, and these two would die. And, like, this guy just walked back, and he was too late, but... Whatever. Kunkka's a DD right now, so his cleave's doing a lot of damage. Bar canes. You should be using these. Nice. You still click on them a bit, which is bad. Hit that creep. Oh, he got it. Um, let's see. I'm just farming. Oh, shit. What's happening? Okay. 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 Oh, no, use your Q! Jacob, do it! Do it! Yes! You got that kill. Nice. You did not get that kill and you died. Never mind. Uh -huh, that's awkward. Um. 
Wow, that's awkward. Okay, um, that was just the fact that Kunko hit his boat and you died for it. He used a Q a little earlier. Q wouldn't have much time to heal. He uses, she has like this ability where she like heals, like uh, AOE or uh, like dot heal. Like she has a lot of regen for a little bit of time is the word. So if you use your Q faster, which is just like you know, click the buttons faster. Hit that rookie. Hit the deny. Okay, you can deny your own towers if you can't creeps, and that's what he's trying. But he didn't get it in time. So by TP, go. There's no more tower in mid, and you should still go mid though. Where are you going? You're walking. Okay, you should TP, because then maybe you could have killed that Kunko with their rookie. If you TP right here, but whatever. Not important. Give me fun. This is where I was lagging. So. I remember because I just like I was lagging, so I was like, "All right, I'm gonna do the most branded thing possible and hit creeps because that's all I can do, or hit jungle creeps." Oh, where am I going? Nice. Wow. I'm like a functional person. Um, you should have, yeah, perfect. Just like you know, get those last hits better. That's just helping the time. Kunk is here. He's seven and zero. Oh. Probably solo kill you very easily, so you should be careful of him. This is a lot of HP on shit. Pretty sure this is where Legion leaves. Uh. Nice! Perfect. That's exactly what you should have done. Perfect. Yeah. Come try to kill you. You got a turn. Got the auto attack. But your support was there. He helped you out. You ulted him. You queued him. Bam, bam, shabam. He's dead. Should be farming this. And you should be using your bottle. To get the mana back. Perfect, you do. Um, I don't know what Ricky's still doing. Maybe he should be like farming somewhere, but he's not. Like, he should be like up here farming, but. It's like just sitting in mid, like, like continuously. You know those like tunnel snake spiders? He's like one of those, like just sitting here invisible, trying to wait for a kill. He's like not even hitting the creeps. Always he is. Good. Hit this creep. No. Okay. Here I am just farming up. Cause I'm lagging. Wah. Where are you going? You're buying an item from the side shop. Never do this. Radiance you should be in lane. Um just send your courier, dude. Send your courier. There's like a auto there's like a key in the curtain. Like if you suck the courier and then you press this button, it will send your thing to the secret shop. I think it's W. So like what I do is I have my courier like bound into H, so I press it, I press H, and I press W, and then I press R to give it the speed boost. That guy ulted the wrong person, he just gonna get fucked. Oh my god, what the hell is what was he doing? Oh, yeah, and that's where he just leaves. He's like, fuck, I died. Wah. Wah. And then he bends. Wah. I don't know. Yeah, and then I say gotta restart because I was lagging. And then Ricky's like, Wah. Anyways. I don't know what. That's an abandoned. All right. I guess you're buying eggs, which is all right. I would buy something else first. You don't have to rush eggs every game. Even though I tell you, like, you play Lena, and you play like fucking. Zeus, and those are two heroes that rush Ags, but like, not everyone rushes Ags, if that makes sense. Like, you probably want a defensive item first, cons especially considering that Kunkka is so far ahead. You want something so that you can live, like a Yule Scepter or a Force Staff, like, I don't know. Not worth I was, okay, I was pausing, I was, pa whatever, you know, um, let's see what you do here. No longer ults up. You heal that guy, good. If you hit this thing and it dies, it gives you a lot of gold, like a hundred gold. But it's not important. Hey, I'm back. 
but I'm still laggy. And this is where Ricky flames me. Ooh, cool. He dies. How'd he die? Ricky killed him. Ricky died too. That's awkward. Right now, this is awkward because everyone's down here killing each other, but you guys aren't pushing the tower, you know? Like. Oh, sorry. That still baffles my mind. Um. Dyer's top tower is under attack. He's right now. You want top to stop the push? Good. Farm these creeps. Good. Good. If I were you, yeah, just keep walking the creeps. Keep farming. Good. Buy your next item. Actually, make sure you always have like two TVs. Radiance bottom tower is under attack. Remember that item in Smite, Shard? Well, there's the exact same thing called Magic Wand. And you should probably buy one of those. The thing is, like, you have to press it, which is, like, hard to remember. Especially when you're new to the game, so... What was I saying? I would just buy it, because it makes, like, you live fat longer. It's not as good as, like, Smite Shard, because Smite Shard was, like, overpowered. Use your boots, by the way. The more you use this, like, the, the, the cool it cooldown's faster, you know, whatever. Um... Don't be afraid to use your boots whenever you just like have a little bit of mana missing because by the time you need mana again, we'll be off cooldown that way. Okay, someone TP's in right here. I heard that. And it's that guy? That guy's not that scary though. Right now, I remember we're just waiting for the rest of them to leave. So as soon as like... Yeah, this isn't really any game anymore. Okay, I'm gonna end it there because now nothing's really gonna happen anymore. I think you get like two more kill or one more kill. But other than that... Remember what I told you, I guess? And... Peace out, Breta. Broteta.